Are you tired of losing money trading cryptocurrencies? Sign up for my free trading AI with over 50% monthly return on your investment. Link is in the description. The price of Miss Peppa Coin Wave soars 13% from the trough. Learn how a new platform for AI-powered crypto signals can help predict the next big move. For the latest coverage of breaking news, join our Telegram channel. Price of the Peppa Coin Wave soars 13% from the lowest. Learn how a new platform for AI-powered crypto signals can help predict the next big move. Late April. If you want to improve your financial future, be sure to hit the like button if this video was useful and subscribe to the channel. The Pepe meme token was introduced on the Ethereum network and had an immediate price increase, making early adopters overnight cryptocurrency millionaires. Since that time, the price of Pepe has been declining, which has led to uncertainty and worry among traders and investors. Pepe, on the other hand, has recently recorded a 13% increase and is now very close to the 50-day moving average, which also serves as a resistance level. The entire cryptocurrency market has been greatly impacted by the recent lawsuit brought by the Securities and Exchange Commission against Coinbase Finance and its CEO, Mr. Chomping Zhao. Pepe and several other MCash prices rose significantly after legal action was taken against these crypto exchanges. It's interesting to note that since Pepe's recent increase in value and market activity, the price of Pepe has increased by 13% despite the market collapse. Pepe has a 24-hour trading volume of $85.7 million and is currently trading at 916,764. In the previous day, the price rose by 4.79%. With 420 trillion Pepe in circulation, the market capitalization of Pepe is $385.7 million. The $85 million in trading volume for Pepe over the past day was a 14.7% reduction from the day before, pointing to a significant decline in market activity. Pepe had its best value in the previous month in May 2023, when its price peaked at $431. But compared to its peak, the price today has significantly dropped by 78.63%. Pepe, on the other hand, dropped to its lowest price of $55,142 on April 18, 2023, just two months ago. Since then, the price has climbed significantly by 1,569.17%, showing a strong comeback from the Pepe price's all-time low. Technical Analysis a trend move in the favorable Pepe's price has dropped after encountering resistance close to the 50-day moving average, which caused it to drop to 86.23. Bulls, however, have taken control by marginally driving the price up. The price may be rising to new heights if it crosses above the 50-day moving average, which has significant implications for traders and investors. On the other hand, if the resistance holds firm, we should see a price decline to support levels around 83.50. Investors and traders should be able to buy the drop as a result. Additionally, the price is still in a bear market because the relative strength index, which is 43, trades below the 50 level threshold. A bearish market is confirmed by the prices trading below the 200 day moving average. A new AI crypto signal platform now offers traders and investors the chance to invest in it. For meme tokens like Pepe, the technology will assist in predicting the next major move and generate passive income from it. Get on board the Apredict bandwagon. Apredict is a Pepe substitute that has a lot of potential. It has a user-friendly interface and a system with lots of research capabilities. The prediction engine of Apredix, which uses financial mathematics to generate market trend projections and specific crypto data, is one of its primary characteristics. The platform also makes use of artificial intelligence capabilities for predictive trading, providing information to foresee changes in the market. This gives users the ability to make wise investment choices and obtain a competitive edge. The cryptocurrency has created a lot of excitement in the industry as a result of its successful pre-sale and cutting-edge cryptocurrency analytics. Rocket and Hashtag set out on an astonishing AI power expedition. It predict? It serves as a doorway to a world of groundbreaking goods and opportunities rather than just serving as a utility token. 
the SEC Stabilization Act, a game-changer for Binance, Coinbase, and Ripple, is unleashed by Congress to oust Gary Gensler. The SEC Stabilization Act, which contains the dismissal of SEC Chair Gary Gensler as a significant component, has been introduced by Representative Warren Davidson in the House of Representatives. By suggesting a new sixth commissioner, prohibiting a party majority, and creating an executive director post as blockchain experts, the measure aims to rebalance the power dynamics within the SEC. We are aware that in the world of cryptocurrencies, regulatory control is quite important. Major action that may change the dynamics within the US. The SEC stabilization legislation was presented to the House of Representatives on June 12 by Securities and Exchange Commission Representative Warren Davidson. The primary objective of the proposal is for Gary Gensler, the current SEC chair, to be fired. Guarding our defenses. Capital markets from tyrannical leadership. As Davidson puts it, U.S. Davidson reiterated his commitment to preventing abuses of power and defending the best interests of the market, saying that capital markets must be protected from a totalitarian chairman, including the current one. The removal of Gensler as SEC head is Davidson's description of this move toward genuine reform. The SEC Stabilization Act was hardly a surprise because Davidson has already stated that he intended to introduce this legislation. Representative Tom Emmer, a co-author of the legislation, expressed his support for it earlier this year in response to a tweet from Coinbase head of legal Paul Gruel. He said that the SEC Stabilization Act will make pragmatic changes to ensure that the SEC's priorities are the investors they are tasked with protecting rather than the whims of its capricious chair. The bill calls for a change of the SEC's authority structure, according to Fox News. It aims to create an executive director position, add a sixth commissioner, avoid a party majority on the commission, and evenly distribute power between the SEC chair and commissioners. Although the legislators' remarks didn't specifically mention Bitcoin, both Davidson and Emmer, well-known cryptocurrency supporters, have attacked Gensler's time at the SEC. Gensler has been branded a bad-faith regulator by Emmer, and Davidson is the vice chair of the new Subcommittee on Digital Assets, Financial Technology, and Inclusiveness of the House Financial Services Committee. The Heinemann papers make reference to internal conversations surrounding a crucial speech by former SEC Director William Hyman in 2018, in which he proposed that when cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin and Ether decentralize, they may transition from securities to commodities. The anticipation is high in the Bitcoin and blockchain industries. The soon-to-be-released Hyman documents could fundamentally alter Ripple's legal battle with the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission, as CEO Brad Garlinghouse has suggested. The potential significance of these documents, which have been at the center of an 18-month court battle to make them public, was hinted at in Garlinghouse's response to a question from prominent crypto influencer Jungle Incorporated on June 12. The internal SEC discussions, known as the Heinemann documents, revolved around a significant speech given by William Heinemann, the organization's former director, in 2018. I appreciate you coming. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video. Until the next video, take care.